Hey Virgo, welcome to my third channel, my Virgo only channel. My name is Chelsea. In this reading, we're going to get you some important messages that you need to hear right now. Today is the 11th of July 2024. Time here in Kuala Lumpur, Malaysia is 7:22 a.m. Uh, Virgo, I'm giving away a free personal reading once a week for a lucky winner. To enter, hit like, subscribe, and comment below. I love Virgo. If you have commented before, you can do it again. It will increase your chance in winning. And winners will be announced on the community page weekly. All right, um, <clears throat> Virgo, let's get your reading started. Spirits and angels, please show me important messages that Virgo need to hear right now. Virgo, please bear in mind that this reading could resonate with you <clears throat> in the past, currently, or in the future. And uh, roles can be reversed between you and whoever could be in your energy field right now. Oh. This card fell on the floor. These, um, I just picked it up. I've got the five of swords at the bottom of the deck. You know, Virgo, the first thing I heard, the first two words I heard was wake up, okay? That's because the moment I saw judgment, three of cups and the page of cups, it's like wake up, wake up to your surrounding uh, opportunities. There's something that you have opportunities around you. For some of you, it's work opportunity, money opportunity, or love opportunities. So um, there are a few here that I'm seeing that you might not see it. So it's time to wake up. Or the nine of wands, time to put your guards down. Some of you, you are aware, but you're afraid to take on these opportunities or that you're not actually aware i don't know who who this message is for but for oh, there's a page of cups right here pisces cancer scorpio it could be an individual somebody who is younger than you are who would actually wish to reconcile with you or see you again hang out with you again celebrate with you three of cups it's some sort of celebration um it's a very social card as well. It's a reunion card. Um, Virgo, some of you currently are being reunited with somebody or with people. But if not, then this reunion event is coming. Um, you're going to be invited to an event where you're going to be reunited. Whatever the event could be. It could be a big event. It could just be reunited with one person in particular because judgment is right here it seems like you know these people or that you know this person before temperance here is in reverse so i feel like it's good look two of cups it's good to be reunited with somebody or these these people because there's three of cups and then there's also two of cups some of you is it's again reuniting with a bunch of people or just one person in particular now temperance in reverse could mean that this um reunion is going to make things balance or it's going to restore harmony between your connection with these people this one person in particular we've got the ace of wands in reverse it feels like i'm hearing the word uh, how do you say that word designers like to use them it's like jujing <laughs> i'm not pronouncing it properly it's almost like this reunion it's going it's going to reignite something because it feels like things have gotten either out of balance or I wouldn't say losing interest, but the fire is not burning as bright as before. But this reunion is going to restore again, restore the connection between you and this person or these people. Now again, this these people, person, I feel like some of you is a group of you, some of you is just one, okay? It could be this person could be a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, could be a fire sign, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo, Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus. Can be any sign. Two of Cups. Someone wants to see you. Someone wants to see you, wants to offer you love, or it could also be an apology. 
somebody may come towards you and apologize to you or car or maybe it has already happened for some of you knight of pentacles is in reverse so some of you is a job offer from someone you've known before it could also be some sort of networking or someone introducing you or recommending you to their boss or to their business partner saying that hey virgo is a great candidate i've worked with virgo before or i've known virgo for a very long time and uh, virgo is going to be perfect for this job okay or this contract this project um, whatever it could be some of you it could be love someone introducing you to someone because they love you they care about you and they like you a lot through cups and they've they have known you for a very long time so they want to introduce you to someone whom they trust um someone they feel that both of you are going to be compatible so there's something about being introduced to someone okay and that could lead to some sort of a union some of its business partnership some of its friendship and for some of you it's romantic a romantic connection now the strength here is in reverse so this for me indicates someone also swallowing their pride swallowing swallowing their ego no longer acting like either cold or act like or holding back from you this person might just come towards you and reach out to you either apologize to you or offer you love or ask to meet with a judgment one sec virgo <coughs> sorry that i'm coughing now <clears throat> virgo again this person could be a uh, Pisces, cancer scorpio or virgo capon taurus we've also got the king of pentacles in my verse hmm. This is interesting. I feel like this could be someone who says, for some of you, this could be someone from your past who couldn't commit or was inconsistent, wasn't stable, wasn't stable, or um, someone who didn't have, who didn't have the courage to be committed to you. Um, it's a scary thing, right? Commitment is a scary thing. It's it's a scary thing for me. I can't even commit to buying a house because <laughs> that's a huge commitment. What if I want to travel, right? Um, for some of you, it's you thinking about committing to something or someone or someone thinking about committing to you, but maybe this person was afraid to fully commit. Um, because of the strength here in my verse. But there is going to be some sort of discussion. I feel like someone might come towards you and say, hey, let's talk about this commitment. Some of you, it's work commitment. Some of you, it's romantic commitment. Let's see more, Virgo. <clears throat> this morning, I woke up and I was like, wait a minute. I feel like everything is like clear. Um, I don't know why that feeling of clarity that feeling of like the heaviness is gone um but anyways this may be for some of you uh virgo because we are connected if you've been watching these readings my readings here and i'm also a virgo if we're connected I mean, we should be connected in some way, shape, or form. It is, it is not a coincidence that you are here. And there's so many tarot videos, so many tarot readers on YouTube. But why are you here? There must be a reason why. We must be connected in some way, shape, or form. So, but for some of you, Virgo, you may gain clarity, okay? Um, and you'll feel much lighter. Someone or someone might come towards you and clarify something to you. And that is going to create a union or reunion um, between the two of you. Okay. I feel like there's going to be a discussion. Like, where should we go from here? Should this be, should we take the connection to the next level? Um, or not? What should we do with this connection? Whatever the outcome is, we don't know because there's always free will. It depends on that um, conversation, that discussion. 
Okay, we've got the Ten of Pentacles here. We've got the Five of Pentacles. For those of you Virgos, if you're not doing well financially, I feel like you might hear some news, some opportunities to either make more money or that you're going to receive more sales um, or get a job. Page of Wands. <clears throat> this is... I like this energy. I like this energy. Page of Wands. It's, it's very refreshing. And it also could indicate you venturing into into a new territory, doing something new that could lead to a lot of abundance. But make sure with the Five of Swords here that um, especially if you are venturing into a, a business, <clears throat> excuse me, <clears throat> sorry about that, excuse me, especially if you're venturing into business, make sure you look at your competition okay check out your competition you can get a better idea on how to elevate and for some of you five of swords it could also mean that someone could be planning strategizing it's like by all means i want to talk to virgo by all means I want to offer this to Virgo. It could mean competition again, Virgo. Some of you, if you've been involved in a competition, I see you winning because the Three of Cups is some sort of a celebration. And your enemy or your competitors may feel upset with you, okay? They might say something bad about you, but <clears throat> I don't see it as a big deal. Just let them be. Um, I see a sore loser here, okay, Virgo, a, a sore loser because you get uh, chosen to do something or get chosen to, you know, Ten of Pentacles. It could be anything. It, it, it feels like once you get chosen, you're going to get everything that you want. You're going to be presented with a lot of opportunities, okay? I don't know who this one is for. But some of you, Virgo, it's someone coming from afar, Page of Wands, who would like to see you swallow their pride and really wanting you. I feel like this person really, really wants to see you, but I also see you, Virgo. Some of you might say no, okay? Because this could actually be your energy, Virgo, Capcom, Taurus. You might just say, no, thank you. Yeah, there's some sort of rejection here. There are two people, a couple of people here, or three. I feel like there will be offers coming in where you might have to reject one or two. And that might upset them. Okay, unless it's vice versa. But I feel like Virgo money is improving. Judgment re-evaluation. Some of you need to reevaluate where you're at right now. And think out of the box because the page of wands is somebody who is very creative with things out of the box. And also check out your competition or people who do the same thing as you do. It will give you some insights. Okay, some tips. And Three of Cups could also mean some of you, you perhaps collaborating with someone would yield a very uh, positive result, especially if you are someone who is like very new in the industry. All right, that's just for some of you. I'm getting like scattered messages here, but just take what resonates with you. But Virgo, when it comes to love, I see somebody missing you, okay, thinking about... Uh, wanting to talk to you, wanting to reconcile with you. And I feel like they are going to swallow their pride or their ego and come towards you, okay? And again, I feel like there is going to be a conversation, a discussion about whether this connection should be taken to the next level, okay? But if it ha whether it happens or not, I'm not sure because it's it feels very open. It feels it's open for any possibilities. All right, Virgo, this is your reading. <clears throat> Sorry for the cough. <laughs> Don't forget to hit like, share, and subscribe. <clears throat> oh gosh, my throat. Um, as you guys know, I have a bit of a, a sore throat and a bit of a cough as well. But I'm feeling much, much better. Don't forget to hit like, share, and subscribe. And subscribe anyways, it's free to subscribe. 
and uh, what else and don't uh, forget to hit on the bell notification button if you want to be notified every time when I post your videos and also Virgo I have two other channels Chelsea Love Tarot feel free to subscribe to my main channel and my travel vlog channel Chelsea Chelsea vlogs um, yeah and don't forget to hit on the bell notification button all right take care Virgo I love you bye